Being at the Discovery Lab for me is awesome because I have this uh, passion for education and I also have this passion for technology. And the Discovery Lab allows me to fuse those two passions. I can teach kids about engineering and they're so young, and they're so eager to learn. And it's exactly what I want to do with my life. So I read um, Sal's book and I was so excited about the mission of Khan Academy um, that I decided to cross the country from North Carolina to, to, to come help out. One thing that makes me really excited about being here is being able to try new things. Um, we get feedback from students every, every day and we get feedback from parents every week and we uh, change what we do based on that feedback. We want them to learn these concepts and gain an, a deeper understanding of it rather than just memorizing. So our approach is having every student 100% engaged 100% of the time. And that's a really difficult thing to do because everyone learns at a different pace, everyone has different interests. Um, some people are more hands-on, some people just like to listen and go from there. And I think that uh, having a great balance of hands-on work versus discussions versus just written work has been a way to really keep the students engaged. What we're trying to do here at Discovery Lab is very different than what students typically do at school. So um, in engineering, there's never a right answer. I think of engineering as a creative art, and uh, students have to come up with their own ideas for solving a problem. So when a student comes to us and says, I don't know what to do, we say, what ideas do you have for how you can solve this problem? We're just slowly trying to encourage students to depend less on us and become more independent learners, because that's ultimately the goal. Um, the students also develop some technical skills. They learn about the circuit, they learn about how motors work and how that can be applied to many different electronics that they use every day. And uh, I think most importantly, the students learn about the relationship between hardware and software. My own way of measuring success in the students is seeing them go beyond the guidelines we've given them to enhance their learning. Applying something they learned in a new way that they have thought of themselves.